I think like growing up, like you always hear the stereotypes of like a female wrestler has got to be like super masculine and they're they're lesbians. And I think like I didn't want to give into that stereotype of like, oh, I'm just a female wrestler and I'm a lesbian. Like, damn it, you know, <laughs> they got me. They reeled me in, you know, like, so I, I kind of hated that almost. And, you know, it was just a, it was a really difficult journey of like acceptance and all that kind of stuff. But the more that I could be myself, the better Jenna the wrestler became because it makes sense. Like when you have your, you know, stability and all your boxes checked, like you're going to perform better because you have all that stuff on your side versus when you're like, you know, you don't have any of that and you feel unstable. You're not going to probably wrestle as well. You're probably not going to do as well in school, you know, all that kind of stuff. But it was intimidating because, you know, people like Jenna the wrestler, but did they like Jenna the person?